Hi everyone, in this video I will mention 10 common problems that second generation Chevy Silverado 1500 trucks are prone to experience. Number 1. Trucks that are equipped with 5.3 liter engines that have the active management system, also known as AFM, tend to experience engine oil consumption, rough idle, and hard shifting. To avoid these problems, it's best to disable the AFM system. Number 2. The steering intermediate shaft tends to experience premature wear, causing clunking sounds when the steering wheel is turned in either direction and while driving on rough roads. Number 3. The fuel level sending unit on a large number of these trucks tends to malfunction. Number 4. Blend door actuators are failure prone, causing the heater or AC system to blow air at a different temperature than the temperature set by the driver. Number 5. The transport case encoder motor on four-wheel drive models that have over 100,000 miles tends to malfunction. When this part malfunctions or fails, the service four-wheel drive message illuminates on the dash. Number 6. The steering wheel position sensor is failure prone. When this part starts to malfunction, it causes the service stability track message to illuminate on the dash. Number 7. The rear speakers tend to malfunction or stop working. Number 8. The fuel pumps in many of these trucks fail before 100,000 miles. Number 9. The built-in throttle position sensor, also known as TPS, on the throttle body unit tends to malfunction, causing the truck to go into limp mode and lose all acceleration. This also causes the check engine light and the reduced power message to illuminate on the dashboard. Number 10. The ABS control module is prone to malfunction on trucks that have over 100,000 miles. The main problem experienced when this part starts to fail is the ABS pump staying on after the truck has been turned off. There you have it my friends. Those are 10 common problems that second generation Chevy Silverado 1500 trucks are prone to experience. Take care.